Why, hello YouTube. This is Tracy HB Picker, and in today's video, I have some motorcycle parts, some um, a couple windshields, some seats, and gas tanks. And we're going to start off over here with the Silverado. This is for a Yamaha. Now, I found one on eBay, but hers is new, and she's asking $249 ship for it. Uh, but hers did not have this, and I know it's dirty, but I don't know if I can clean it or not or just leave it. But it has these down here, which I'm not even sure if they could be, if they even work or anything. Because I have no way of testing it. So I'll just put that parts on test, but hers didn't even have that. So I don't know if that's plus or minus. But I'm going to shoot for $100 on this. And like mine has scratches and stuff, but it's not like it's going to a collector. These are bikers. They tear shit up. Um, next, we have the Spitfire. And by the way, I got all of these because my brother owed me some money and I told him you know what if he wanted to pay me back by giving me some stuff that he's no longer using because I know he has a ton of crap that he don't use and he pulled out this stuff and he never thought about it before because I was mainly a clothing seller and I didn't really care for anything big but even though I don't drive I'll just set it out for the mail and let them uh, pick it up but I got a scale that weighs up to 75 pounds so as soon as I get boxes for this stuff, it's going to be listed. Um, this is a Spitfire. The ones I've seen on eBay are not tinted. Mine is tinted. Uh, my brother still has hardware for that one on his bike. That he says he's going to get off. The other one's going to be sold without the hardware. And if he doesn't get it off his bike, then I'll sell that one without the hardware. This big old seat right here. That's off of an 86 Kawasaki Vulcan, Vulcan, and I think it was a 750 Vulcan because I think that would be, if you would look into my other videos, you'll see one where my son is on the bike, and that would have been the bike that this was originally used for. But, they, somebody, I don't know if theirs was new or used, I gotta look that up yet, but they had 120 shipped on it. Uh, this is an 05 Yamaha V-Star 1100 seat. And there's a backing that's supposed to be for that. Now, if you have the backing, it goes up to, you can get probably about $150 for the front and the back seat. With just the front seat alone, it would be $78. Now, my brother says he has the back part of this. So I'm probably going to wait um, to list this until I get the other portion. So obviously I can make more money. And when I was looking these things up, I kind of got excited for a minute because I was seeing some in the $600 range. But then I realized that it didn't, wasn't quite the same. It was for the same motorcycle. But there's, like how mine has these going around, theirs had something like that. I'm not sure if it's the exact same thing, but on the sides they had like leather straps hanging out from each side. So, I'm not um so i was really excited about it at first but any 150 dollars is still going to be a good deal when i get the other second half of the seat but if you find one for a yamaha v star 1100 or actually doesn't even have to be an 05 it just has to be a yamaha v star 1100 seat um if you can get the one the way i described it and you can go ahead and look them up on eBay, you'll see what I'm talking about. They're going for 600 plus. I wish I had that seat. Uh, this is a Yamaha 81 400 Special 2 seat. And this was going for about $50 shipping. This gas tank was part of the same bike as that Vulcan seat is. Um, not Vulcan, V-Star. And that's just the front seat. I'm missing the back. But that's a gas tank that goes for that. And this still has gas in it, so we got to empty it out yet. And I'm not going to reuse the gas, course, because I don't know how long this has been sitting. But this is also missing the gas cap. 
and you put tape over it and you can tell it's eating away I'm not sure if I'm just gonna leave it take a picture like that or because it needs a gas cap and I get why he did that or whoever had it before him did that but we'll see uh, how I'm going to end up listing it. But we got to get the gas out first. There's stuff that needs to be done before I can list this stuff. And this, I'm trying not to get my shadow in the way. Uh, but this is a 76 Honda CB350. And this, this tank I could not find on eBay at all. I found like the accessories for it, like a gas kit. I did not find the actual tank itself. Um, so I have no idea where to price this in particular one out at. I don't know if it's rare. I thought about starting it off at auction at 30 bucks and seeing where it went, but I'm not really sure how I'm going to price it. I guess I'll take another look and see if I can find them a little later on when I get ready to list it. But that was basically my haul that I got. And I really hope you enjoyed this video and keep your eye out. I'm really hoping to, that the stuff is uh, sells fast as soon as I get it listed and remember to um, check out my playlist and remember to like comment and subscribe on my videos so have a good day YouTube stay blessed bye bye